Smallholder commercialization is a business enterprise driven approach by smallholder farmers as he or she grows crops or rear livestock. A commercial farmer focuses on farming as a business, adapt technologies that increase profits, reduce unnecessary cost of production or marketing, join a group to pull up resources and supply to large buyers collectively. Key terms. Commercialization. For a group of farmers, refers to transitioning a farmer group or association from subsistence farming or disorganized to market-driven farming for increased profitability and better incomes. Market-driven production entails having market in mind, producing crops or livestock based reliable information on markets, adapting better technologies, reducing the cost of production, collective marketing to reduce the cost of infrastructure and cost of marketing. Factors of community commercialization Preparing the producer to take up a business approach throughout the entire process for realization of maximum benefits from the specific input use. Ensuring that the enterprise emphasizes a business market-oriented approach at all levels to facilitate less costs. Producers forming business units with a clear membership guidelines and allocations of duties and responsibilities. Producers pulling resources together to source for inputs and produce enough for the identified markets. Barriers to commercialization. Common barriers to commercialization include production constraints, social constraints, marketing constraints. Smallholder commercialization process. Smallholder commercialization refers to an agricultural transformation process where the individual farms shift from highly subsistent oriented production towards market led production targeting both their input procurement and output supply. Structural transformation is attained through smooth process of smallholder agricultural commercialization, strategic interventions to improve the functioning of input and output marketing, improvement in service provision, and infrastructure development. Factors to consider commercialization process. Agricultural commodities. Staple or high value commodities which depend on agroecological circumstances, technical know-how of smallholders and risk bearing capacity and attitude towards risk. Target markets. The choice of target markets depend on the nature of targeted commodities. Crucial factors to consider includes product quality, sanitary and phytosanitary standards, quantity required, timely and regular supply. Trade. The main focus is mobilizing farmers to build economies of scale, integration of smallholders into mainstream value chains, and increase the competitiveness of smallholders. Principles of collective action. The smallholder farmers under collective action are bound by the following principles. 1. Voluntary and open membership. It is open to all who meet the requirements in the bylaws and are ready to accept them. 2. Democratic administration. It should run on the basis of one member, one vote, regardless of how active the member is in the group. 3. Dividend or repayment. If the activity is run by the group and the group any surplus, it should be distributed among the members depending on their contribution to the surplus. 4. Promotion of education. There should be education for all the members on various issues. 5. Beneficial to all members. All efforts of the group should go to the interest or benefit of all the members. 6. Objective. To promote principles of collective action within the group members.